Hello, in this video, I am going to show you how to resolve the safe side error when you try and install an application that has, I think, been blacklisted or SideQuest doesn't want to install it. How do you do that? So let me show you an application. If I go to here, and obviously this assumes that you've set up SideQuest. I've got videos covering that on Linux. So I will provide a link in the description to the Oculus Quest playlist. Plus, this is this video is applicable to Oculus Quest 2, Quest 1, and Go, and potentially future headsets as well. So if I grab this application right here, application APK, as you can see, we get this safe side error. So how do you resolve this? So you need to use ADB directly in terminal. So if you close this down, we don't need this anymore. Actually, just one thing to mention. What we're going to do, we'll only install the APK. If you still need to install like an OBB file, you can still do that by, you know, going to File Explorer, Android, OBB. I've covered that in a separate video, so feel free to check that out. So the OBB part is still the same. It's just the APK part that is blocked. So to do that, if you open up your terminal, first of all, you need ADB. If you've been doing stuff with Android development, you probably already got it. If you haven't, let's run the command sudo apt install adb click enter it will ask you for your password this is your user account password the password will not appear even in you know password character which is like the asterisk but it is typing then click enter it will download and install it's pretty quick for me because i've already got it installed this is pretty quick in general anyway so it shouldn't take too long now if i was to type in adb we'll get this if you don't get this just give you a restart if you get some sort of error now if i type in adb devices so you'll start you know the daemon if it's not running and there we go the device is right there if it gives you some error along the lines of Thing like you dev wrong or if, if it gives you something some, some sort of error about the device leave the device plugged in put your headset on and you'll probably have a dialogue come up on your headset saying allow access to files and folders just allow that if you get anything but you know if you have any questions or you get any problems just let me know but now that we've got this we can actually install our application to install it you put adb install dash r which is recursive so that overrides any application of the same type same you know same one already on there great for updating and now you just drag and drop the apk like so click enter and this is about 60 meg or so so it shouldn't take too long as you can see it's successful one of the caveats with this is it doesn't give you a progress bar so if you've got something that says a gig or two chances are if it's that big it's probably separated in an obb file but if it's not let's say if it's pretty big you might be waiting for a while and it can be just a bit daunting if you're waiting 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 and no progress so just wait patiently and you'll give you a success that's it and now you can put your headset on and in the unknown you know the unknown sources section in the library where you normally would play your side loaded games you can play this so as usual this video is not condoning piracy this is just showing you a route if for some reason you get the safe side error for whatever reason and as usual i look forward to seeing you in the next video